Well, it worries people when I say this, but actually everyone can benefit from the fast forward programs. And, and this is why. Um, really, the fast forward programs are built on a concept of what we call brain fitness. So that it maximizes the brain's potential to learn. And maximizing the brain's potential to learn is the same as maximizing your body's potential to have better endurance or have better strength by working out. So just like going to the gym and going on the treadmill or doing some lightweight training is good for everybody, it builds everybody's muscles, it's especially good for athletes, and you might say, well, an athlete doesn't need that, but now there isn't a an athlete in the world, I don't think, that doesn't do aerobic and weight training in addition to learning their sport. And fast for word is weight training and aerobics for the brain. That's just exactly what it is. It's, it's accelerating the brain's capacity to process information faster, to learn more easily, to hold on to information longer and more reliably, to pay better attention. So children with learning issues benefit dramatically from Fast for Word and from the Fast for Word programs. But we have research that shows so do gifted children benefit from Fast for Word. We have research that shows that students getting ready to take um, college entrance examinations and the graduate record examinations and the law boards and the medical boards benefit from the Fast for Word programs. We have research showing that adults who have strokes benefit from the Fast for Word programs um, and adults who have traumatic brain injury. Now the question becomes one always, and this is what I like to emphasize, the question becomes one of time and expense. So if it's a school district and we want all of our students to be better learners, we might actually decide to have Fast for Word programs for every single student in the school. On the other hand, if we want primarily to target our underachieving students, we feel, well, we're reaching our achieving students, but we want to target our underachieving students, that's how we want to spend our time and money, then that is the place where you get your most bang for the buck because they are the ones, underachieving students, that have the most room to improve and are going to show the greatest overall improvement in learning. Um, but I, I wouldn't exclude a athlete from aerobics and weight training and for that reason anyone who thinks they'd like to learn better or faster can benefit from the Fast for Word programs. There's nothing magical about them, there's nothing scary about them. They're just designed to maximize learning capacity and potential.